This video demonstrates some advances we have made in sweeping edges across faces in TD Direct 5.8 Patch 13. Prior to this update, it would be very difficult to do a swept mesh on this surface. Because this pipe bends, there are intermediate edges. This intermediate edge would be a destination for one segment and a source for another, and the mesher does not allow an object to be both a source and a destination. So let's take a look at this geometry. The structure tree shows that this is one surface. However, I can select individual segments of it. There are currently no tags on it, and I've already taken it through the options on the Repair tab to remove split edges. The first thing I do is select an outer edge. Then Mesh Control, Swept Mesh, Use as Source. Now I'll go to the other outer edge, select that, Mesh Control, Swept Mesh, Use as Destination. The intermediate edges will be worked out by the mesher, and that's the big improvement. You don't need to do anything to them. The number of layers can be set individually for each segment. I could double click to select the entire pipe and then apply a single number for every segment, or I can select them individually. I'm going to select the three longer segments. Mesh control, swept mesh, five layers. And then I'll select this short segment, mesh control, swept mesh, three layers. Then I'll press escape to make sure nothing is selected. Mesh controls, advanced default, I'll turn on curved mesh. I'll also set the mesh size to be 0.5 and the curvature refinement to be 0.4. That should be a nice coarse mesh. So then I'll just come over here to Thermal Desktop, create a new link, and there you have it a swept mesh across multiple faces.